Hey everyone, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Mystery Case Files Return to Ravenhurst, and let's get started. Alright, so where we left off, we had finally gotten into the uh, side of the house here. I had to do that uh, domino pieces puzzle. I couldn't figure that out, honestly. Um... I honestly don't know what else I'm supposed to do in here. Um, can I go? Oh, I not saying no. All right, let's well, so I can go back into here. And oh, looky, already we got more puzzles. Okay, so it's not one of those they click it. So I'm actually gonna have to find the puzzle for the answer for that riddle. Uh, let's see, let's see, what's this over here? Form ticket of... Pati oh. Form of patient admission. Uh, that's really hard to read. Uh, Dirt covers the glass frame of what appears to be a medical form. Uh, now we got that. A tripod sits before the window. Is that really all? Oh! oh. We finally used that cloth, and if you actually had looked back, it was the um, second time I had done the kitchen scene. Yeah, that was like the first or second episode, no, second or third. I'm gonna go second because I keep saying second. All right, so skull and crossbones, hollow looking left, solid looking left, looking front, looking right. Looking front. Okay. Let's see if I can remember this one. Crossbones. Hollow looking left. Solid looking left. Looking forward. Looking right. Looking forward. <laughs> Yay! Um, I don't know how well you guys could have had it. I actually, uh, my dear son, I am entrusting you to maintain the grounds and various machinery in this, in and about the estate. Any disturbance to your family will cause my plan to fail. Divert the intentions of curious parties by any means of your disposal. Praying I should be closed permanently. Remember that I, remember that I have left you reminded a few reminders to the elevators combination about the properties I am counting on you son please do not fail me your loving father Charles I don't think Charles is actually capable of, capable of loving anyone and it's one of these puzzles yet I honestly hate this kind of puzzles Uh. There we are. Uh, I still need to work on the but there's so yes, I am just gonna keep doing this until I've gotten it. Cause eventually I will. Hi, <sighs> yeah, yeah,
encounter. Um, I'm not going to skip it just yet because I do have a hidden object that we also need to take care of. Alright, so I think we're going to do this and then try and figure out the lock. So I'll be back in a moment. Alright, we're back with the last one. It's a star. And... Oh, it's in the ink there. I, I honestly wouldn't have looked there. Skull key. Okay, that's one of the first things I found. Uh, why would I need a skull key? Well, at least we said it. Uh, what a creepy, hateful old man. Um, yeah, sorry, I was just kind of looking at I, once again, have gotten a walkthrough for this, but, um, no one, it's like, you know, you don't, you know, you just click on the star until you get the image you want, kind of thing, and it's like, well, it doesn't really help, because... No. I'm not all that good at these things, so... And yeah, they said I can skip the puzzle if I want. Um... But I've been skipping a lot of puzzles. And like, if you actually look at my time here, it says I've been playing for 6 hours, and if you look at my videos, Apart from the stuff I've taken out, I have not been playing for six hours, and that's because I think at least two hours of it, two and a half, well, two to two and a half hours, is me skipping puzzles. So, yeah, I've skipped quite a few already. Um, few, uh, pieces here. I think I read that one. Yeah, I know I read that one. I think I read that because it's always the two pages at a time. So yeah, I think I read that one. Okay. After making my way back to Victor's cottage, I made sure to peek in the window and re-enter after verifying his absence. I've got to search for clues quickly. Update. I've discovered an alarming tidbit in Victor's bedroom. A framed patient admission form hangs above a nightstand next to his bed. After dirty glass, I am presented with a disturbing rumors of Charles's path. Apparently his obsession with supernatural has gone on for some time. Even his own mother knew he had some serious issues. Lunatics asylum at the patient with anomaly. Uh do not ask me to read this. My uh I cannot read handwriting to save my life, so uh, but it gave us the code, so that's really all that's important. Uh, I just overheard Victor and Charles outside the car the cottage. Charles has returned. There is little time. I've got to finish my search of the cottage without detection, or I, or I too may find myself a permanent part of the mystery. What did Victor mean by "We'll get you back in your chamber so you can feel the warm embrace of your family"? I'm terrified by what me what that means, but it's too late to turn back now. I found a sol soiled reminder note on the floor of Victor City. Charles has apparently chain charged Victor to maintain Ravenhurst Manor and the surrounding grounds. The passages about prying eyes uh, grabs me with anxiety at the image of still being trapped in the attic. Remember that I have left you 
you reminders. Hmm. I wonder if these are related to you, to the unusual number sequences I came upon at the front gate and other locations during my investigation. Um, what that means is, let's just go back, and if you can't my mouse clicking, I'm sorry. Oh, these things, okay. These are tidbits here. Those are the reminders he's talking about. Yeah. The stuff we found at the beginning of the game. So, let's just... Okay. Um... And you see, I can get the middle part. There's the feathers here that I'm having trouble with. Uh, I'm, yeah, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna trouble you guys with that. I'm not even gonna try and figure it out off camera. I'm just gonna skip over it. I have a telescope, I think, that goes on what they call a tripod up here. Technically, for me, a tripod. Okay. Got, yeah, see? These things. Here. Uh, for me, a tripod is something you put your camera on, but I guess it could be a, a, a stand for something, so. You know something to do every day. The crest in Ravenhurst study has... Oh, the chest in Victor's study has secured... Was secured with a tacky peacock. Tricky peak... Pedlock. Padlock. Oh my gosh, I can't read today. But it was no match for my crafty detective work. Opening the chest exposed a brass telescope aimed to emit a pile of smelly overalls. I paused briefly to consider what Victor would use the telescope to view, when I remembered the tripod near the window in the upstairs bedroom. After placing the telescope on the tripod, I peered into the eyepiece and made a revealing discovery. The weather vane on top of Ravenhurst Manor was crafted in ornate ivy and its design in barely another usual pneumatic sequence. I think we have quite a few of those now. Um, what I'm supposed to do with those, I don't know. Um, but I have a skull key. Now, if any of you have been paying attention, or gone back to rewatch things, you remember that I've needed a skull key for a little while now. Why have I needed a skull key, you may ask? You're about to find out. Yeah. I'm actually recording earlier than normal. I normally record around 9 in the morning after everyone has left. Um, but my little sister had left school, I uh, left for school early today. So, I was actually able to re start recording earlier. Um, yeah. Skull key. Uh, no, I don't know how this works. Um, honestly. I don't know how it works. I didn't understand this when, um, uh, um, when I was watching a playthrough of it last time, can I go up? Uh, it's just for some reason. Oops. Okay. Uh, like I said, I actually don't quite understand how this works. Uh, just somehow these numbers are supposed to equal is what equals up to the answers here. So. Oops. Uh, like I said, I don't know how it works. Um, I 
I was looking it up. Um, I've been looking it up, I still don't quite understand it. Sorry, I'm just kind of spacing out because, um, I'm actually just like looking to see uh, how much left we, how much we have left of the game. Now I think we should finally, yeah, we should we're able to enter in here. We still have the hammer, and I don't know why. World's best dad loved Charles. The frame photo of Victor and Charles makes me uncomfortable. Yeah, you think? Uh, the team details the construction and operations of a strange of strange equipment. Okay. Uh, wonder actually how much we have left of the game. Uh, Jeweled Heart. Oh, do we only have like half of it or something? Huh, anyway. Jeweled Heart, um, oh, sorry. Uh, see you guys in a minute. Second. Alright, I'm back, and we have to find a badger, and actually I just see him up there, so I don't even need to use the hit button for once. Yay! Um, I went ahead a little because, um, I have a walkthrough beside me. And I have to apparently find about 10 of these, I think, roughly. Uh, sweet Emma, in time you will forgive my sins. The world of the living will forever divide us, but I shall bind you close to me in the darkness of death. Fear not a solitary passage, dear love. In time I will send you a beautiful rose and her lovely daughters. <laughs> Sorry. A beautiful rose and her lovely daughters. The fellowship will provide you everlasting comfort and gre and greet me the gift of life. Yes, the locks that keep you. Will, yes, the locks will keep you, but in time they will rot. Even their greatest power is no rival for eternal ghostly scratchings. Um, the only way to be with you and maintain the doors is by crossing the space between life and death. Your compassion, your compassion will give their souls to me so that I may have energy to remain within the void. I shall also bring you a son who will preserve Ravenhurst Manor as we dance within the walls for all eternity. Accept this locket as my final gift. May I forever remind you of our love you family. Yours forevermore, Charles. Um, yeah, the thing is, he keeps saying that Charles is a madman. But if you actually need to look into it, he, crazy he may be, yes. But in his own twisted way, he does still love, um, Emma. And it's just... It's creepy, but it's also sweet, and I'm a sucker for stuff like this, so yes, I I do find it very, very, very sweet. So, yeah. Anyway, I have the eerie feeling I would... Oops, is that... How do you read that? I have the eerie feeling I'm moving closer to the darkness that permits the twisted passageways beneath the manor. A rough pool grotto deep beneath the surface weighs homage to Ravenhurst's namesake by means of a shrine surrounded by several hundred candles. A letter snug beneath various offerings details Charles' ultimate and rather twisted in intentions. Uh, yes, the locks will keep you remain within the void. The power contained within the ornament locks appears substantial to deter 
I'm not even gonna try that word, over time. Charles hints that he seeks to walk between life and death, but somehow trapped into the energy provided by the souls of Rose and her daughters like some kind of ghostly leech. This explains his existing of after all these years. I must pr proceed with caution, else I too reheat my life to refuse his madness. To fuel his madness. Um, okay. I just thought it was shiny. I didn't know I could actually collect it. Um, so, like I said, I actually did kind of go on ahead. Um, now, I don't know if it actually will fit in there. Okay. Um... Yes, but I have gone on ahead, and I actually do have quite a few more hidden object scenes. Because um, apparently I need to collect quite a few of these uh, hearts. Uh, I'll have I'll have ten when I'm done. I have. Three right now. Oh no, okay. Ten that go around, this one goes in the middle. Okay. So eleven. I have eleven. Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to save this for the next video. Um, I honestly thought we would be reaching the end by now, um, but I guess we're not. Uh, <laughs> and I'm a little sidetracked at the moment as well. Anyway, I hope you guys are enjoying this. I, uh, I really hate trying to end off my videos. I never know what exactly to say. I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. Like, favorite, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Oh my god, that really scares me. Um, uh, I'm to make it. Um, sure, baseball bat, chloroform. <laughs>